the calculator can also perform combinations. The way that it notates the combination is a little bit different, however. So uh, given the problem that's uh, coming up in your section, um, you put the 18 down first, so that's the number of items that you're choosing from. Then go to the math menu and over to PRB. Come down to the third option, most likely, NCR, that's your combinations, and then put the number of items that you're choosing at a time. So in this example, it was six. Press enter, it will calculate the combination for you running through the formula. So uh, you won't necessarily need that formula to work any of the problems in the textbook um, or the homework. Um, just as long as you're able to use the calculator efficiently.